morning. Um, I think I like the the morning uploads better. Um, we'll see because uh, pet sitting starts, and you know when I'm up and out at 4:30. We'll we'll see. Uh, but I am driving around a lot, and then it gives me time to think, and I might come up with actually a good topic to talk about. Um, uh, can I talk about how much I don't like movies? Can I talk about how much I don't like TV? Uh, Big Daddy loves it. And he wants to watch a movie. That's his thing. I'm like, hey, let's watch a movie. I'm like, okay, great. I'm going to take a nap. I think I've touched on this more than once. Um, that's one reason why I picked up crochet. Because I actually can sit and be productive in the same room as him. Uh, and he feels like he's sharing some quality time uh, with the boob tube. Um, I used to like TV. I used to love movies. Oh my god, I was like a huge movie junkie. Uh, and, and credit watcher. Like, I knew who the casting agent was. I knew who the grip was. I, all of it. That was, like, my thing. Oh, my God, in the 80s, holy cow, if Penny Perry casted it, it was the best. Like, best movie ever, because she handpicked the best people. Um, but, I, I don't know what happened with movies. Other than... The Hollywood formula is boring. It's the exact same movie every time. Exact same movie every time. Just different faces in different location. Um, nothing is smart. Um, there's, there's no wit. It's just, you know, they call him Michael Boom Boom Bay for a reason. Uh, you know, and at the end, well, okay. Here, I just really, when I said boom boom, I get it. Uh, so, um, I'm hard of hearing and it's frustrating it's just so frustrating to to watch a movie and you can't hear what anybody's saying because a foley is just like in the front like the foley should be in the back foley is the sound effects and when it's just so loud you can't hear the words when the music to rule your emotion is so loud you can't hear people talking. Um, that might be artistic, maybe. Because um, you're just like so caught up in your emotion that you can't hear what people say. It's frustrating. I'm a lip reader. So, uh, I do what I can as far as lip reading. But when it's an action movie, it's just sound effects. It's just booming. And that is so loud. So the sound effects are so loud that it's just uncomfortable to sit in a theater. And then the voices are so low. And I'm not the only person that I have heard say this. And it's always typically someone who has some type of hearing issue. It's the same thing. It's just like, why has it got to be so loud? So I have to turn it, if I, if I watch them at home, we have subtitles, but I'm fine with that. Perfectly fine with that. Closed caption. Um, because it doesn't have to be so loud where the sound effects are just ridiculous and making the windows rattle because you're constantly adjusting the volume up for the conversation, down for the sound effects, up for the conversation, down with the sound effects. So it's work. So, I have noticed that I love documentaries. Because you know why? There's no sound effects. It's just talking. So, the levels are right. The levels are perfect for talking. So, I love a documentary. Because I can get involved in it. It's not uncomfortable. It doesn't hurt my ears. Plus, it's learning something. So, there's not a formula. Like the, Holly, the classic Hollywood formula. Um... That makes everything so predictable. And the other thing, too, on a documentary, it's always the slant of the documentarian. So it's their slant. So, uh, honestly, what's their take on what they're doing? What's their view? Are they really pro about it? Or are they con about it? In the end, um, it makes me research more. 
to find out more about that, to get another side, another perspective um, of the topic they're talking about. <coughs> I love that. I love that. So I'm learning something. Um, and then, freaking YouTube, short attention span theater. Oh my God, because everything is, well, not everything, but as I scroll through and I'm looking for something, which is typically almost always a how-to, because um, I want to learn something, I don't know where this is coming from, sorry, um, and then I have, like, I have the people that I like to follow, they're entertaining and they're short, um, I'm going to rattle off who I, my guilty pleasures are. Timmy Tomato. Oh my God. I love him so much. He is hysterical to me. And now I have James hooked on him. And we just freaking love him. Um, Simply Neological. Love her. Um, I love the transformation of uh, Manny MUA. Um... I, I love I love to watch him do makeup and he's gorgeous. Um, Colleen, uh, who does um, Miranda, Psycho Soprano, holy cow, holy cow, so funny, so funny. And then Vsauce, uh, I love Vsauce. If Vsauce is still out there, because I haven't looked for a Vsauce in just a hot minute. Um, that's my that's my go to as far as like the top top channels. Um, I do like Graveyard Girl because she's just a spaz. She shouts everything she says. <laughs> I love her. Um, and then they got a couple of the indie ones that I like, um, and I can't think of her her name. Um, she she crochets and I love her. She's from like Scotland. She's adorable. Um, and there's a couple comedians. I mean, there's there's several. So, I mean, that's like my TV watching. And I can watch it in 20 minutes and I'm done. Uh, oh, God. And I'm just I'm completely transfixed on... Um, is it ASMR? AMSR? And ice eating. <sighs> it hurts my teeth. How? Oh! <laughs> I just like dive into this ice and just chew. I'm just like, oh, it's a train wreck. I can't stop watching. Oh my god. Mm. Oh, teeth hurt. Teeth hurt. So I don't even know. I don't even know how I just dived into that rabbit hole. Holy cow, but I just did. Um, so anyway. Did I even talk about Star Wars? Did I? Well, we saw it last night. And I didn't like it. At all. It was too long. It's two and a half hours of my life. I can't get back. Ridiculous. Um, I hope you liked it. <sighs> but I had dinner and a nap. <laughs> so it's my morning. <sighs> Say it with me. Dude, you alright? Okay. I'm good. Alright. Can't have a video without cookie. Come on, lovely lady. Come on. No. All right. If you ever want to have fun, have a calico. Ridiculous. Wait, I just totally lost track. Uh, be peaceful. Be kind. Talk to you tomorrow.